What's going on, awesome people? So check it out. I got another package today. Uh, as you can see by the package itself, there's obviously not an invertebrate like a tarantula or anything in here, but um, this is something I've really been waiting on. Gosh, uh, two or three months now. I'm, I'm just uh, super excited to get into this package because I have been waiting so long. I've been so anxious for this. <clears throat> so, um, I got in touch with a company called uh, Custom Grips Arizona. Arizona Custom Grips out of Arizona. If you heard me mention the word grips, you may know where I'm going with this. I found some grips for uh, my stainless steel 1860 revolvers uh, and had them. So I sent the parts that they needed, which I'm about to show you right here. Um, really awesome. They got these made in the USA stickers on them. So you know that they're uh, quality made. These parts are metal, but he uh, wrapped them anyway. Oh no, these aren't the uh, other parts. These are the uh, grips. Okay, so what's in this package? This must be my other parts. Okay, there we go. So here are the revolver parts uh, that I was speaking of. These I had to send to him to custom fit the grips. This is the, uh, I'll get it out of the back so you can see it. This is the back strap which goes across the back of the grip and attaches to the frame of the revolver. And then of course this part right here is the trigger guard. So he needed both of these parts off of the revolvers to custom fit these grips and uh, so that's what he did. Um, and the reason they took so long, besides the fact that they have been busy, uh, I think it was one of these, the back strap he was talking about. These things are mass produced, so they're not handmade. <clears throat> so not all the specifications are completely accurate. Apparently there was a high point on one of the back straps to where the uh, grip would have rocked or something. So they had to uh, fix that, mill that down or whatever. And apparently they had to make special tools in order to do that so i really appreciate that they went the extra mile on these things and uh they're finally here i'm looking at one of them right now and i'm telling you guys this thing is absolutely stunning so here i'm going to show you the grip these are two piece a lot of the ones online are a one piece this is a uh, age distressed it's it's supposed to be a it's a supposed to look like ivory and all that kind of stuff but of course it's uh, safer for the animals and the environment and highly durable but um these are just super freaking awesome i really wish i could get my camera to focus a little bit better on them because uh there we go now if i can zoom These things are super freaking awesome, and I'm so excited to get them. I mean, it's it's been a long, anxious wait, but there you go. There is, and he even wrote on the inside, JR1. My initials, and of course, the uh, that's the first grip. And then, of course, they have got their information stamped on the inside here, Arizona Custom Grips. And then it says uh, Magna Tusk, which is the um, artificial ivory, basically. Uh, and, this, and then it says Pieta 1860, which is the revolver that I have. So that's really cool. Now I'm going to go put these on my stainless steel revolvers. And I'll come back and show you what they look like. I'm so stinking excited. Hang tight, guys. All right. And so here we go. We have got... One of the rips on the revolver and let me tell you guys this thing is just absolutely stunning um big shout out to arizona custom grips for all of the extra work that you guys did on these fantastic grips um the really cool thing about a lot of their grips and they have different uh revolvers and stuff like that i found them on ebay so that would probably be the best way to search i just put in the model of 
revolver that I had and was looking for some grips. This is one of the sites that popped up. One of the cool things, features, is that uh, the ones that have the medallions in them, you can actually choose from a few medallions. They have like the Gold Liberty Eagle. They have uh, a silver Colt, a, a gold Colt, and then the red Steer Skull, which a friend of mine's son helped me decide on those. And then, of course, this distressed ivory-looking material and the checkered uh, part, which is the reason that I uh, bought this model rather than the uh, smooth ivory which I still may get because of the better grip but I could not be more excited my revolver really could not look any better again one more big shout out to Arizona Custom Grips and a big shout out to the rest of you guys for watching thanks so much for watching take care of yourselves and each other have a fantastic day or night wherever you are God bless